Local contractors see a boost in business after last week's storm left a trail of destruction around. Good evening and thanks for watching tonight. I'm Todd Blackington. The past week's wind storms caused a number of headaches for East Idaho residents, but for some local businesses, the blustery conditions have led to a recent boom on the bottom line. Logan McDougall has more. If you're like many East Idaho residents, you're probably missing a few shingles after last week's winds. But for area contractors, your loss is their gain. It's increased. Yeah, tenfold. I, we've received over 92 calls as of today, which we receive usually two or three a day during the winter. And with shingles missing, homeowners could be in for another round of problems if they are not repaired. If it's not patched soon and we do get some more moisture, um, water will enter the home um, and ruin your sheetrock. Uh, you could be over time dealing with mold issues. A uh, $95 to $110 patch can save you $1,000 down the road. Hohalter says it's not only roofs that the wind raised havoc on. We had a tree in a driveway, we had a tree sitting on a garage, and we had a couple trees just sitting in a field. The fence has fallen over, cedar fences. Um, your cedar posts, they're not like your tr pressure treated wood. Um, they eventually rot. And Holhalter says while he is thankful for the upswing in business during a normally slow time of the year, he does feel for those affected by Mother Nature. It has improved the business part. Um, I do. I, I, I do feel for some of the homeowners though, because it does. It, it just. It's one of those things that you can't control. You can't control the wind, and you can't control what it does. Logan McDougall, KPVI News 6. Now, according to National Weather Service statistics in 2010, 33 people were killed nationwide by wind-related weather.